too much trash. Butte County's Neal Road landfill is filling up, but Public Works has a plan to solve the problem. So I went out to the landfill today to give you a look at what's coming. I'm here at the Neal Road landfill where the Butte County Public Works Director tells me some big changes are in the works. He's working on a facilities master plan here where basically you'd see an expansion of this landfill out to the north, to the east, toward Paradise area, and they also own to the west. All of this is county owned property, 240 acres that they already own because at this point, the only thing they can do is keep on expanding upwards. And the uh, Public Works Director told me that basically in about 30 years they're just not going to be able to go any higher. So the way that they would do these expansions onto the land that they already own is basically by raising rates. Right now if you come out here and you drop off some trash you're going to be paying about $42.11 per ton. Uh, PAC tells me that's below the average for the state and for our region. And right now they're assessing whether about 61 to 70 dollars a ton might make way uh, for some of those improvements that we're talking about and now when we look at this master plan it could be another access road it could be more administration buildings from what they have here you could see an expansion of recycling as well so some big changes are in the works but again new county supervisors this week told pack they heard his plan and they told him they're just going to have to look into exactly how they could potentially raise rates, what they might look like, and what the timeline would be. We're going to bring you those updates as the county moves forward with the plan. So, Haley, I mean, most of our viewers should be aware there's a new law in California that requires that we recycle food waste. So how does that fit in? So when I was talking to Josh Pack, the Butte County Public Works Director, he told me that they basically have within those 240 acres around the facility, they have a space that would be designated for recycling food waste. But right now, they just don't have the technology to make it make sense to do that. It really will cost less and use less energy for them to just ship it out of the area. Mm. But if, you know, if something changes or they buy a bunch of chickens, as I like to say, <laughs> then they do have the space where they can move forward with that. They're still going to comply with the law, though. Yes, yeah. they will. It's just right now, it will be shipping it out of the area. Interesting. Yeah.